Hey guys, thanks for checking in here at the 6th Year Garage. Today, I'm going to take you inside my truck and show you what product I use to keep my dashboard crack free. Uh, this is a 1985 dashboard. It's original with the truck, never been replaced. And you wonder why it looks so good when so many of them look a lot like this. They usually crack one here and one here. Sometimes they'll leave them bubble up like you can see here. And uh, my dashboard, actually, it's got a hole in it. Uh, this is from a parts truck. My dashboard doesn't have any of that. And that is because I use one simple product Ever since I bought this truck, once a year, I apply baby oil. That's it. Simple. It's all natural. It's, I mean, it's for babies. So you know it's good for dashboards. One ingredient, mineral oil. And fragrance. But I'm not concerned with my truck smelling nice. I'm concerned with this dashboard staying crack free. Today, I'm gonna show you how I do it. Baby oil, paper towel or a rag. Squirt some on and wipe it down. It's that simple. Now this is pretty dry, I haven't done it in a while, but you can see how dry my dashboard actually was by how shiny it is now. And uh, you know, I try and do this once a year. That's probably more than enough. The stuff does not evaporate quickly. It, uh, it'll last a long time. And make sure, even if you have to get a Q-tip, you get down in these areas around in here because you know, you don't want to leave any of these dry, especially if you're parked out in the sun often. If you're wondering about this gauge pot here, uh, it's not attached right now. I had it Velcroed on, but the Velcro wore out. It is from a 1985 Tercel, and um, you'll notice it has the two tilt gauges, but it's missing the altitude gauge in its place. It has a, a little four-wheel drive uh, thing that lights up when you put it in four-wheel drive. I wired it up so it all worked. And I had to modify this to uh, fit the dash a little bit, but this was on eBay for 50 bucks versus the 300 plus dollars that the ones for these trucks go for. I bought this dashboard from a, a parts truck and I'm gonna try and find a way to maybe fiberglass or do some sort of repair on this and uh, actually bolt this down to it. Obviously I'm not gonna bolt this down to an original crack free dash and put any holes in it. So if you guys got any thoughts on that, uh, let me know in the comments below. If that's a tutorial you'd be interested in seeing me do, um, let me know and I can document that as well. So that's it for today. You can see now, it's nice and shiny. It's gonna absorb all this mineral oil and uh, keep it from getting dried out and cracking. So thanks for watching guys. Keep those Toyotas on the road and, and keep your interiors looking good and crack free. Oh, one more quick thing. All these door handles, they dry out and they just get kind of chalky. Well, once again, if it's good enough for babies, it's good enough for your Toyota. Check this out. Look at that. Gets rid of that chalky finish. Makes it look like new again.